The best way to explain Crawl is that this is like Sharknado with a bigger budget that completely turns out better than that piece of shit. So Crawl is directed by Alex Andre Aji. I hope I say his name right, I don't think I did, but he's the director of Hills Have Eyes, and it's produced by Sam Raimi, who did the Evil Dead movies, the Spider-Man trilogy, and also produced some films as well, like Evil Dead Remake and Don't Breathe, and this movie is a new horror slash survival movie and disaster film at the same time, and this movie tells the story of this Category 5 hurricane that's going to wipe out this Florida town, and this girl named Haley in the film, played by that chick from the Maze Runner, I can't say her name, who basically is out there breaking all the hurricane evacuation rules to go out and look for her missing father. She goes to this abandoned house where he used to live in and she found him, but we find out that he is not alone. He is surrounded by a gang of vicious alligators. So they had to figure out not just escape this hurricane, but also escape from these vicious alligators. First of all, we don't get much alligator films, we get a lot of shark movies, we get snake movies. The only like crocodile alligator movie I know is a movie called Rogue, a strange horror film, that I thought is just really ridiculous and shit. But we got this movie and I feel like yes, that is what I wanted to see. I just wanted to see alligators kicking ass. I want to see it as a really fun, stupid popcorn fun. But this film isn't really that. It actually is a good film. I was literally surprised about Crawl. I literally liked this movie more than I thought I would. And that's really good because this is definitely the biggest surprise of 2019. I didn't expect this movie to be that good, but I really had a lot of fun with Crawl. First of all, the biggest standouts of this film is Haley, played by that chick from Maze Runner. As I said before, I couldn't say her name, but I gotta say, she was fantastic in the film as the main protagonist. I thought everything about her character was very, very interesting, and you do root for her to look for her father and try to escape from these vicious alligators. And I thought her character was really great in the film, but the biggest strong point of this film is her character between her and her father. I think that's the biggest plot point of this film that has to be very strong for a situation like this. And honestly, their chemistry was fantastic. Also, the guy who plays the fire movie, he was from Saving Private Ryan, you know that sniper guy. I thought he did a really great job in this film also. And I think the chemistry was fantastic in the film and it does hold up for me and you do root for him to get out of this house before this huge heroic hurricane is coming and destroying the town. But I'd like to talk about the thing that everyone's excited for. The alligators. They look great. They made alligators in this movie more terrifying than I thought it would. And yes, this movie was scary. It actually scared me a couple of times. I actually jumped a lot of times in this movie because the alligators, the way they use the alligators is terrifying. They're ginormous. They're terrifying as shit. They look great. There's only one part of the movie that I feel like they did overlap the CGI. It has to do with the thunder. When the thunder goes on the alligator, I thought that looks too CGI. But for the most part, the alligators look really good. They look terrifying as shit. And it, you do root for them to get away from the alligators because the alligators is basically the antagonist of the film. And they did a great job as the antagonist of this movie. But also the hurricane's a character also. It's also the antagonist. Like, yeah, an animal and the weather are antagonists of this movie. And they made that look terrifying. And I really like that. And this movie was suspenseful, thrilling, exciting, and that's why I want a film like this to be. And thanks to Sam Raimi producing this film, he made it like that. Like movies like Don't Breathe, it's so terrifying, it is entertaining, it is suspenseful. This movie is the same thing, maybe not as too suspenseful as Don't Breathe, but you know what I'm talking about. This movie is just what it is, and it knows what it is. It's not trying to be that serious, it's trying to be a film that's just a summer popcorn fun. And I think Crawl really did that for me. I like the style of this movie as well. The cinematography looks really, really good. The style of this movie looks great. The look of the hurricane looks very good. It looks scary and terrifying. The house looks great. I love the set pieces. They look really fantastic in this movie. And it's not looking like a happy film. And that's really great. It makes this film so depressing and looks ugly in a good way. And I like that in this film. But I do have a couple problems with Crawl. First off, there are some dumb horror decisions in this film. Thank God this movie came out in the summer. Because if this movie came out in the winter, I think everyone would notice how dumb the decisions are in this film. Because this movie does know what it is. But there are some decisions in the film that I feel like, are you freaking kidding me? Even the ending of this film, I thought it's a bit rushed. Like, I feel like they could have added more to the ending of this entire movie. Also, there are some characters in the film. There is this, like, police officer character that was related to Haley's character. And I just thought he is so annoying in the film. But there's also guys that are in a gas station and film. And I feel like these characters are just there to just get killed by alligators. Because that's what everyone wants to see. 
Sort of, but not really. We wanted to see more chemistry and more excitement, and I just feel like those are just quite obvious death scenes. But that is it, guys. Overall, I had a lot of fun with Crawl. I actually liked this movie more than I thought I would, and that is great. This movie is intense, exciting, it's thrilling, the characters were great, the chemistry between Haley and her father did its job well. I really like the look of the alligators, they look terrifying and shit and ginormous. This film is a very exciting film and you guys should go out and see this film whenever you can. I'm going to give Craw a B plus. So guys, that is my review for Craw. Guys, let me know what you think of this movie in the comments below. If you like the film, hate the film, or thought it's okay. But also, what is your favorite monster movie? Just also, let me know in the comments below also. Make sure you guys follow me on Facebook, Stardust, Instagram, Twitter. Keep contact with me and make sure you guys subscribe to my channel and notify for my latest reviews. And, have a nice day.